Okay, folks, this is more than you can handle because you know what we're dealing with today. We're talking about racist. And guess what? President Trump did not say anything racist. But that, see, that, that's what the alt-left and you know the, the Democrats and Nancy Pelosi, all those ne'er-do-wells, oh, man, that was racist. Why? Because they're black? You know, because they're wearing ethnic garb? Uh, does that make it racist? No. And then he said, oh, go back to where you came from or uh, whatever. Yeah, okay. Uh, maybe it wasn't the brightest thing to say. You know what I'm saying, folks? I'll fess up to that. Say, so what do you mean? And he was inflammatory. And I think that's what he was intended to do. He's just fed up with these creeps. Go, oh, America, this, you know. And uh, the border says, you know, that is but the, the what, what, what's a Cortez? You know, you know, how about stuck on stupid? But that's what she does, you know. And by the way, she has done some uh, very notable uh, presentations uh, uh, that I've seen on uh, CNN and all that, uh, that Fox News, C-SPAN, and all that stuff. Okay, but that does uh, she takes away so much from? Oh my God, I don't want to tell you, especially this uh, illegal alien detention thing. And for all these people in detention, so forth. I say, hey man, I don't like. Maybe this isn't as cool as I thought it was going to be. Uh, they get a free ticket immediately. Do not pass go. Do not collect two hundred dollars. Go back, a plane ride, boom. Imagine that. Uh, back to where, where they came from. Okay. Uh, but as to the uh, uh, four young ladies, and, and we have continuing in the the Tribune today. These people and their uh, letters to the editor and fear mongering and all this crap. You know, this country is in such dire straits to build up and defend itself that my god if these people are nauseating they they can't, they can't even do the numbers there's an alpha called numbers usa just go go on the internet and, and put out that they're not prejudiced not biased not racist or anything it's just the numbers okay and so folks uh, things are changing it's a, a, a desperate world out there all the way around and but it's this racist crap you know, get over it, get on. That They're just a diversion so that they don't have to deal with the realities of life. And I'm so happy as hell that this, oh, this guy, he's not suitable. What, what, what does it, what, what is the measure of suitable for a president? Especially when you consider some of the last past things that have done. And wait until I get to this one uh, that the person had written about, uh, Patrick Henry. Oh, uh, he's a, uh, 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 a, a, a hypocrite and, and, and a, a bad person and, and all that and because he owned slaves that made him very rich. Hey, you stupid fool. What are the times that you lived in? Okay, you can step back. Oh, oh from this 21st century. Uh, Jesus, it makes me want to vomit ah, to all these dumbass people that want to take and rewrite his, oh, hey, they own slaves. You're so stupid, it makes me want to vomit. I mean, you're an insult to the human condition. Why don't you shut up? But this is what you do. Just run your mouth with stupid pouring out of it. Okay. Bye, guys. Again, it wasn't a racist comment at all. Don't, and no matter how many times they say it, I'm going to change it. It wasn't racist.